Occasionally, it doesn't hurt to get a little historical. And so now I would like to render you my poem entitled Some Pertinent Thoughts of Julius Caesar While He Was Being Assassinated by Percy Dove Tonsils. <laughs> well, here I am, old Julius Caesar, ready to make a speech. It's quite a crowd out here today, all within arm's reach. Goodness, so many friends showed up. There's Brutus, Cassius, and Mark, and the little boy selling knives on the stand outside the park. Oh, there, that soothsayer coming up. She hustles on the Appian Way. If she mentions the Ides of March again, I'll give her a sock today. Oh, knock off that jazz, the Ides of March. And please change that dreadful old dress. And may I ask if you must whisper so close, do something about your breath. I guess I'd better start my speech. First, I'll just clear my throat. <coughs> oh, will someone take this soothsayer where she's worse than inhaling a goat? Now, first, I'll tell these rubes that taxes are going down, and I'm clearing up the slums on the outskirts of the town, two chariots in every garage. Smog control in the metropolis, free violin concerts by Nero, and free orgies in the Acropolis. I'll just keep it modest, sincere, and quite simple. First, I'll flash him a smile and show him my dimple. Friends, a funny thing happened to old Caesar today. I was walking along the Appian Way. Oh, hail there, Cassius. How's the kids and the wife? Say, are you eating salami? What's with a knife? Why are you sticking me? Oh, gracious, you've bent it. Look out with that switchblade. This toga is rented. And Casca Trebonius, ouch, ouch, inhale. You boys all got knives. There must have been a sale. Oh, I'm beginning to falter. I'm pale and quite drawn. It's hard to make sense with this going on. Now, watch it there, Publius. Do have a care. I know by your name you hardly have hair. You just wait, Publius. Have your fun while at your bar mitzvah. From Caesar comes no sundial. Octavius, true to your name, you're quite the old card, eh? Stuck me eight times. Two fours. That's the hard way. Calpurnia, my wife, that crazy blonde lout. Just let my blue cross and insurance run out. You here, Lepidus, you old such and such? Not with a hatchet. No, no, that's really too much. Brutus, et tu. You stared me, old pard. Heavens, you've punctured my diner's club card. And it's rather ridiculous, but it's charming, isn't it? Now let's go on, shall we? Mm -hmm. 